Yeah, it certainly is. Um, a lot of work we've been like, and you know, it's paying off now. You know, we've enough, a lot of years up and downs, and um, you know, we've made a lot of progress this year. I felt, you know, a lot of younger fellas have stood up, um, especially today when we needed them. Uh, Kev Donovan, Colin Mann, you know, and it's coming together, and there's great belief in the squad, and you know, we're back where we want to be, to be honest, yeah. And bonus territory or not? I don't think so. No. Why would it be bonus territory if you work That's hard enough and get results? Um, we're in the all quarter final. We set out to be there at the start of the year and we're there. So I think hard work pays off at the end of the day. Yeah. And in terms of the core of Brian, it's been nicely going that way, I'd say, since the league? Yeah, like, you know, we worked on our, our structure and whatnot. Division 2 was a tricky division, to be honest with you. Um, you know, and, you know, it didn't work out the start of the year the way we tried to play. And I think we tweaked a few things and... You know, other players came back from injury and whatnot, and it worked nicely. And I think ever since the down game, you can see the results. Um, it's been very, very good, and training has been very, very good. And uh, we're getting the performances we want. That even today, I suppose, if I'm being very honest, I didn't think we were there. You know, we played fairly poorly to what we can do. So hopefully, that will come the next day. Very forward, Brian. It was a very different game to this was last uh, last Saturday against them. Yeah, it was. There was a bit more room there today, to be honest with you. You could play a bit of kicking game. Um, but in fairness to Limited, they still made it very difficult to us, like, you know what I mean? Um, you know, I know we had half kind of goal chances. Cahill did brilliant for the goal, and Kevin, in fairness, the half backs, you know, they were causing trouble all the second half. And uh, Kev, Kevin Matty broke the line, and, you know, we were lucky to get the, the second goal chance, really. Um, but it was a different game completely, to be honest with you. You know, there was more space, kicked the ball, and uh, there was more free flying game, to be honest. That scoring burst, like you mentioned, the, the Colin Manny goal, that's pretty key. Did you feel a little bit more relaxed then? Yeah, like we knew. Look, the outside public probably was a bit different to what we knew inside the camp. We knew, you know, in fairness, I know Billy Lee, he's, he's done great things with Limerick over the last few years. Um, he's, he's brought him up the ranks, in fairness to him. Uh, and we knew it was a tough game. Like, you know, at halftime, we knew we, we expected it to be a battle and we knew we'd have to empty the tank in the second half. And I think we did. And look, it's job done. It wasn't that pretty, to be honest, from our side of it, but it's job done. We can, you know, do our homework now and say looking forward to the draw. You got a bit of praise for the after Kerry game for kind of competing with them for three quarters, but how important was it to kind of back that up like, with two performances? Yeah, you know, that was the outside public. I still wasn't happy with the end result, if I'm being honest with you, uh, and my own performance. Uh, you know, I think, you know, I think we played into that game with 14 players for five minutes of normal time, probably six time, uh, six minutes of extra time. Uh, the, the flag gone off, and I think we used all our subs. So Kerry tipped over four points, five points in that period, and. You know that's that's probably something we need to look at, like you know, uh, from the managerial side and also from our own, uh, you know, to make sure that we at the end of the games we're finishing more correctly. But um, I think we've we've come up, we learned a lot from the game. Um, I know the two last games weren't as pretty as you want to the football style of it, but we got the job done. How's, how's the body? Well, he's sore enough to be honest with you. <laughs> I'm getting old now to be honest. Uh, myself and John are working there, the oldest in the team inside there, uh, but. It was still a physical game out there, you know, there was, there was a bit of contact and whatnot, but uh, come here, you'd be buzzing at the same time, like, you know what I mean? Adrenaline's still in me, so you, you get that, you get, you get over that. Now, Jeff, for the last question, because he has been the most support. And just the one on, on uh, well, sorry, I was referring to the, all the issues you've had, like, uh, injury wise over the last few years. How, how are, it, I suppose, is that something you still have to manage? Yeah, it is certainly. Everyone has to look at everyone has their own stuff, you know, to, to, to be looking after, but. Uh, it's been a long old road now and you know I said to one there, we're back where we want to be and hopefully we can back it up down the next day. It's good for Cock Football to be back up in Croke Park. It's been a long enough road and uh, we're looking forward to the next game. Yeah, is that when your combination with Stephen Sherlock, you can kind of get a good understanding Stevie kind of told me Yeah, yeah, like Stevie, he's a great guy, like you know, some people forget his age, he's still very, very young and you know, sometimes you'll be, you know, we have to give it to each other as well, but it's definitely working some bit, but uh, look, he's young, you know what I mean, there's still pressure on him, but he, by, by God, he is, he is performing, like, you know what I mean, when he picks up that issue, even the, the pressure from the freeze, it's great to have in our locker, and uh, there's no, no doubt about him, I, I presume he's man of the match with Kevin Donovan today, so fair play to him. Thanks, Thanks, Alex. All right,